a very good morning. Today is a bank holiday here in France. So we did arrive at Disneyland Paris. But sometimes you know that you know that the crowds are gonna be a bit crazy. And if you're here for a few days, nothing better than taking a visit to the city of lights. And that's what we're about to do. So for all the ones who have never been to Disneyland Paris or wondering why would you drive to Disneyland if you go to Paris? Well, that reason is quite simple. If you stay in one of the hotels on property or even off property where you have a free bus or a free parking, you can go to Disney because just behind me, Disney Village, and there's the tower. So we're actually in the middle, but right on the other side, of everything that's Disney is the train station so you can just come over here and take your RER that's what they are called right to Paris Just 40 minutes and a short walk away, you're at the Notre Dame in Paris. That's how fast you are from Disneyland Paris to ride in the center of the city. So this is where I conclude the trip from Disneyland Paris to the city. I'm gonna continue the video. I'm gonna take you along uh, in Paris. If you're only here for the Disney stuff, then you should, you should stop watching right now. Come back next week or next video and it will be all Disney for you. But today, it's gonna be Paris. Look at that line to go inside. So it starts just right here, it goes all the way to there. And then there's another line, a second one to go in. And there's one on the side that is actually twice as long as this one. So crazy day to visit the Notre Dame but it's a beautiful day to do so So, if you do want to be unique and 
attach your love to this bridge, it's possible together with the other million. This is crazy. Je suis toujours à la fête quand tu me tiens dans tes bras. Just for all the people doubting about the nice place and the most romantic place, all those locks that you've seen that are right there, they come from here. It's thick glass. You can't hang your love locks anymore on the bridge. Although the lamp posts are not doing that bad. And once they start, just one hanging on another look at this look at this thing that's crazy people are crazy uh, 60 tons of metal were taking off this bridge when they removed the lava well, around about 60 tons that's huge, that's huge. <laughs> I think this might even be the second most famous pyramid in the world. Sunny Paris. The Louvre is, of course, famous for its Mona Lisa and people going like this on each and every picture. It's always fun to see. They didn't used to do that when the pyramids weren't here. I don't know why they do it now. Sometimes it's just nice to sit back and relax. Okay, we are going to consider this as a must do. And the other side of the Champs Elysees, the Arc de Triomphe. And way up there. Ooh, look at all the people. Okay. So if you ever in Paris, I do recommend on the juicery. It's not that big, but they do have great food, healthy and organic, so come check this out, juicery.
we had a great lunch. If you ever want to go to the juicery, it's a five minute walk from the Paris Opera. I would doubt there's a lot of entertainment at 3 p.m. It's nice to just come and see what the building looks like. Let me hear your flow, sisters. Hey, sister, go, sister, so, sister, flow, sister. Oh. here thank you all for watching I hope to see you real soon in one of the other videos and be sure to subscribe to the channel see you soon guys bye bye